Hey, what's going on guys? It's the Android Guru here, back again with another video. Now before we get started, I would like to wish each and every one of you a very happy new year and may every one of you have a great year ahead in 2017. With that being said, today's video is about the top 10 best apps for January 2017. Also, today's video is a collaboration with a couple of friends of mine. So if you guys like their parts, be sure to go over to their channel, subscribe and watch their videos. All of them make amazing stuff. With that being said, let's get started. All because of you. Next app on our list goes by the name of Rocket VPN. Now, essentially, it's a virtual private network application which you can definitely understand by its name. Now, this application basically creates a private server for your internet connection, whether it's Wi Fi or your mobile data, and you can connect it to a server from all around the world now currently I've set it as United States and basically what this allows you to do is keep your personal information while browsing the internet private and safe and therefore no hackers slash you know other people can't read your information from other devices now you can also select up different servers for different apps as you can see and you can set them so if you want to customize it that's up to you but all in all it's just a really great application that I think everyone should check out and again it's free and link is in the description below so definitely check this app out you're gonna have a very safe experience on the internet to be precise hey guys Akshat here from TWA and the next step on the list is native clipboard you could say this app as a clipboard manager of your phone how this works is it keeps everything that you had copied in its memory and when you double click on an empty field it shows you a block list of all the things you had copied in the past. Tap on any one of them and there you have it. You also have the ability to edit what you had copied. I just can't say how underrated and useful this app has been. Give it a shot. I'm sure it's gonna make things easier. Okay, so my first pick is this app called Empty. This is a fun app that lets you send an empty or a blank text to your WhatsApp friends. Traditionally, WhatsApp doesn't let you do this and so not everybody knows this trick, but I had an absolute blast messing around with my friend with this trick. Just download the app. Hit send and choose your contact. That's it. The only downside to this app is it has a shitload of ads, but other than that, it's a really fun app. The next app is Wally QSD Wallpaper. I'm sure most of you are always looking for amazing wallpapers, and Wally has one of the best collection of HD wallpapers. You have got various categories to choose from, and there is also a feature tab where you will find some of the best curated wallpapers. The app itself is very simple and has a very clean user interface. You also have the option to choose between a dark or a light theme for the interface of that. You guys should check this app out for yourself. So the next app on the list is Fluentd and what it does is that it brings smart reply suggestions to any text messaging app. So how it works is that once you get a text notification, you'll get a smart reply button and once you tap on that, it'll show you a whole bunch of suggestions for you to reply. And in my usage, the suggestions that it provides are pretty spot on with less formal messages which are more accurate and seem original. So overall, Fluentd is a very handy app you should install. It's a free app on Google Play Store with the download link in the description. Okay, I'm taking the next app on the list. This app is called Pixel Filter. Studies actually show that slow Wi-Fi and a low battery make people frustrated. What's wrong with that? It does. So this app named Pixel Filter helps you save a ton of battery by just dimming your display. No, 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 don't jump off yet. It is not like any usual filter app. This app actually turns off the pixels present on your screen, meaning you only have some percentage of the display being lit up. How cool is that? And the best part is, it just seems like you've lowered the brightness a little further down. The display is completely visible with zero strain or distortion issues. It's been more than a month since I'm using this app and this far, I've really liked it. My next pick is Film Square. What appeals to me the most is the clean design of the app. Everything is very well laid out. It's a one-stop shop for all you movie buffs out there. You can discover new and popular films, read reviews and find out a plethora for the details. Additionally, you can also favorite a movie if you want to come back and view it later on. Overall, it's a very nice app and it's definitely something I'm going to keep for a very long time. So the next app on the list is called Conscient. Now in short, it's a more condensed version of If This Then That with simpler actions. How this app works is that you need to create a fence in which you will select a trigger or a context and also an action which will get triggered. Here I've created a fence which will launch Spotify automatically whenever I plug in my headphones. And just like this you can create pretty much any kind of fence as per your liking. Conscient again is available on the Play Store for free and is linked in the description. The next app is Polar Photo Editor. 
when you open this app, you can take a picture or import one from the photos and just add some basic filters to the image for some quick editing. But if you want to take full advantage of this app, you can dive deep and adjust everything from color, light, details, curves, toning and so on. There are a lot more editing options in this app. But one of my favorite is the ability to add mask adjustments to a particular part of the image. You can expose, blur, darken, saturate or repair any specific part of the image by adding multiple mask layers on top of each other. Definitely give this app a try if you are into advanced photo editing. Alright, next up we have Delta and Delta is a icon pack application which is filled with material design slash Android nougat type of icons that is going to help you keep your customization game on fire. Now it does not really have a lot of icons like other icon packs since it is still a relatively new application but the icons have a really nice feel to them and each one of them has been created with precision and I really like the colors and wallpapers that go with it. Speaking of of wallpapers you also have a dedicated wallpaper section that you can check out while browsing this icon pack and the wallpapers are pretty high def and really good in case you want to use them with the icon pack and that is it it's a great app so go ahead check it out and that is pretty much it guys if you guys like this video you know what to do leave a like and subscribe to my channel as well as each and every guy's channel who was a part of this video once again a very happy new year to all of you guys and with that note i'll leave you guys hope you guys like this video this is the Android Guru signing out. I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out.